the Shure SM7B versus the Tonner TC20 XRL condenser microphone. Uh, this is a real co quick comparison video I'm going to do today for everyone here. In case if you're interested in any one of these microphones, obviously you probably know about the Shure SM7B. It's a lot more expensive, of course, and I'm running it with a FET head as well to boost the signal. And I'm running both microphones to a focus right, the Scarlett 2i2 interface. And also, the Tonner one comes with um, a whole kit. I did an unboxing video of that, of that as well. You can check that out here as well. It comes with pretty much the boom arm, pop filter, shock mount, and a cord and everything else like that. And it's a very inexpensive microphone that you can buy on Amazon. There's a link down below as well um, that you can check out. And I'll put a link for the short microphone as well down there. Um, so it's a great starter microphone. The Shure SM7 is obviously a lot more advanced and you probably see a lot of YouTubers and professional broadcasters and stuff use them. It was also used, I believe it was the microphone for Michael Jackson's Thriller that they used. Uh, Bono from U2 uses them, Red, Red Hot Chili Peppers, a lot of male vocalists and stuff like that. Um, really good microphone for like hard rock and stuff like that for singing. But today, however, I'm not doing any singing or recording of any other instruments. I'm just going to do a voice test between the two microphones. So let's get right into it. Leave your comments down below which one you think sounds better, which one you think is, you know, you're going to get, if you're going to get any of them. And I will run the test and we'll just see what happens. Okay, so this is the test right now. I'm actually talking into both microphones at the same time. This is the Shure SM7B that I'm talking into. As you can hear, it's a little bit more, um, uh, less room noise, if you will, a little less um, high end, if you will. It sounds kind of more natural to me. Now we're talking into the toner microphone with the pop filter on and everything. And I have the windscreen on the microphone as well. Let me take the windscreen off the microphone. And this is what it sounds like with the pop screen still and without the, the windscreen thing on there as well. Again, back to the Shure SM7B. And I'm doing a comparison between these microphones. And you can judge for yourself. Please do leave in the comments below what you like better. And now I'm back to the Tonner microphone as well. I believe I'm pronouncing that correctly. I'm not even sure. Uh, so this is the sound difference between the two microphones. Um, yeah, check them out. Okay, so cool. Uh, let me know what you think. Um, in my opinion, the, the Shure SM-B um, is a lot more professional sounding quality. I mean, you don't need it if you're just making YouTube videos and stuff like that, obviously. But, uh, you know, it's the, the Tonner one is a great bargain. Starter kit, whatever you want to have. Low budget, short budget, whatever you want to call it. But let me know your comments below. That is all for now, and I will talk to you soon.